Galactic Federation of Light, Sheldon Nidal, September 22, 2015. 5 Chicken, 18 Zip, 12 Manic Selamat Balak. Over the past few months, this world has progressed ceasing to be one in which the Dark Cabal is still in charge, to one in which those nasty thugs are on the ropes. The different groups of our Earth allies are finally realizing how the scene of this world need to be accommodated. The extent to which awareness is raised in this realm, the changes of the financial system and the new prosperity require to be disclosed. We ask that a set of precise procedures are done at a much faster level. This guidance, as we said earlier, was largely ignored. The time is ripe now for these changes manifest themselves and are explained to you. The prosperity that comes is simply a tool by which you can achieve your dreams. Use these symbols of power to remake their world, to one that is peaceful and harmonious. Be aware of what you are doing. Let everything flow in synchronicity use your powers to change things gracefully and divinely. This world needs to change and change the way he sees himself. Old violent forms require an end. The diversity of culture requires being honored. You need to live in a wonderful land with technology to end poverty and hunger. The world needs to see himself as a great and glorious family. While his kingdom moves toward your new reality, never forget who you are and who you are becoming. Never before has the Earth's surface humanity had the ability to free yourself from all the evils that torment since the Great Flood of nearly 10 millennia ago. At that time, the Anunnaki, as his Dark Lords, put in place a system that, in fact, caused suffering to all. You are at the point where this great suffering is to be transformed. You are entering a time when prosperity and new governance will allow you to turn Gaia in the paradise. Mankind will no longer agriculture mining and other things that harm your precious planet. You are rapidly developing a new perspective which can allow you to use your growing awareness to change all cultures in Gaia's surface. This new global mix of humanity is what will set the stage for our arrival. You can finally stop believing in Kabbalah lies. Government can formally end the cover-up of UFOs and prepare them for our coming. This will allow us to begin a series of broadcasts on our initial goals. The first objective involving our mentors. All of you have lived in sublime ignorance from birth. You were created with a patchwork, first conceived thousands of years ago by the Anunnaki. These perceived realities have to be discarded, and new insights must be ordered based on a new and more conscious set of realities. This old Anunnaki mother made it more flexible, and it was much easier for their government masters and others, to manipulate and control you. These checkpoints must be replaced by free thought and a newly acquired skill that allows you to again discern what is being used to tell when you're being manipulated. This will be the major task of the mentor who will be granted to you. This needs to be done subtly, an inclusion and restoration of their ancient and modern history. This story is filled with important truths they have been distorted. Some of the truths behind their wars, and how its economy is used as a pawn by the oligarchy, is something more than enlightening. Are you preparing to become a galactic being human? The time spent in the last 13 millennia needs to be revised and the rationale behind fully explained heaven's decrees. Another objective will describe to you what it means to be a galactic human. You regained abilities that let you carry out divine instructions from heaven. You are, in effect, a physical angel. This means you can do a number of things. The mentor's job is not only to review your life, but also to explicitly explain to you that your life comes from mindfulness. It's science question which implies a full answer. All this will be explored with you for the mentor. We have a long history with you. We are helping your ascended masters seeing that you are in a state where they can ask for heavenly help. This process, at present, is somewhat distorted by matrix, which creates this reality. This matrix is now being greatly weakened by the big waves of energy that comes from the galactic nucleus. These energy waves are helping significantly what our Earth allies are managing. This joint operation is on the verge of a wonderful success. Will be to bring the new reality that is to reconcile you with our families inside the Earth and spiritual space. Hosanna. Blessings. We are your ascended masters. We came with great news and wonderful news. 
The dark cabal is full of himself. It defies everything that our associates make land and therefore it is time to destroy their power. Gaia is merely pawn for them, and they use their horrible devices to make points useless for our various allies. Darkness is now on the verge of its demise and our many allies are applying their own little heavy blows to defeat these bunglers evil. Ahead of you, my children, is a more beautiful reality and full of joy, freedom, and prosperity, and the new governments will be devoted to their mutual happiness. The old must be an old and a new era of care for Gaia will be the beginning of its growing dedication to the divine service. Together, we are forming a union of great help to everyone on Gaia's surface. There will only be peace, cooperation and a growing awareness serve, for you and Gaia. You are building a more beautiful kingdom. Heaven is coming down to earth. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! This reality is in transition. He is blessed and is awaiting orders from heaven. Great divine love waves are increasing as we speak with you. Be willing to listen and be moved by the passion of these sets of wonderful events. This kingdom is moving each of you to a state of consciousness higher and higher. You are participating in a movement that embraces all peoples and all nations. Our blessed task is to keep them focused and toward the center of the most gracious and divine light. When you are exposed, it becomes physically different. This difference is minimal. However, it is part of a process that is changing this reality. We, the Masters, we are excited about the significance of this great spiritual change. This is causing many of you to become more spiritually oriented. Every day, we find beings willing to ask for our help, and we ask our numerous partnerships to provide this blessed help. You are very close to a new and blessed day. This kingdom is now in transition from the dark horrors. This means that everything will change in a flash? Not really. What you need to do is stay positive. Be ready to receive. Always be ready to use these positive energies to help support the demonstration. Do you know how powerful you are, and the more positive you are becoming? You, dear children, are the light of this world. You can a light that no one can extinguish. Use it to bring the wonders to rapid fruition this time. Remember all that you really are. Be strong and unwavering. Let the dark knowledge that their day is really coming to a sudden end. You are a set of magnificent beings who have the privilege of seeing miracles, which are to appear soon before you. So, be able to remain strong and positive. We are behind and ahead of you. We're pushing it and guide you to the very worthy finish line. Today, we brought a weekly report on what is happening around this globe. The spirit is constantly moving over the waters of the realm preparing this orb for your great shift into a new reality. This land is alive and ready to be filled with miracles and divine actions of heaven. Know, dear ones, that the countless supply and never-ending prosperity of heaven are indeed yours. So be it. Salamat Gajan. Salamat Ya, Syrian 4-1. And be in joy.